because in this video I will show you how to install and set up Java in Visual Studio Code so you can run and compile Java applications in VS Code. So let's get started. First go to your search bar and type download Java and now you will see options from java.com and oracle.com. You need to choose oracle.com one. So click on Java downloads and as you can see it shows Java 20 and Java 17 are available now. So we will choose Java 20 because we want the latest version. Now go down and click on Windows because we are downloading for Windows 11. Now click on this x64 installer. So it is downloading. Once this is downloaded, you can just open the file directly from here. Or if you are on a different browser that does not allow opening, you can open where it is downloaded and just double click on this and click next. And this is the default path where it will be installed. So you can change the directory, but I will not change it. Hit next. And once JDK is installed, you can just finish close. Now you know you do not need to install JRE separately as it is included in this. Now if you type CMD. And you can just type Java dash dash version to see what Java version is there. And as you can see, Java version is Java 20, and we have already installed Java runtime environment and Java JDK both. Now let's install Java Pack for Visual Studio Code so that we can create Java projects and run Java projects in Visual Studio Code. Go to Google or search bar and type download Java Pack for VS Code. And now Click on this first result from code.visualstudio.com that is Java in Visual Studio Code. Now you can scroll down and there will be two options. Install the coding pack for Java, Windows and Mac OS. Click on Windows. And the downloading will start. So as you can see, Java coding pack download is complete. Now you can click on this to open it or you can just open it from the downloads folder. So I'll just click on it wait for some time it is opening up now click on this i accept the terms in the license agreement make sure it is selected and not unselected and click on next and it will now show you the jdk version that is installed and visual studio version that is installed and click install as you can see the download is complete now we can launch visual studio code and we can run java applications so click on finish and visual studio code will open once this is open, you can click on open folder or create a Java project. So let's click on create Java project. It will give you option to choose product type. For now, you can just click on no build tools. And let's create a folder in our desktop. Let's create a new folder. Project. Click select project location. My Java project and now your first Java project is created you can click on trust the authors and there is already a sample Java file created here inside source and in libraries there is empty because they, we have not added any libraries here so now you can just run this project allow access and as you can see, hello world is printed and we have run our file successfully. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.